It's a good idea to carry chains with you if you're driving around today, and it is required on state highways when the conditions are icy. Yeah, that's right, but we wanted to know why transportation officials don't use salt to help melt the ice. Well, Brent Weisberg went to find out why. He's live in Mobile 6. Brent? Jenny and Ken, good afternoon to you. We just got a word from uh, ODA there telling us that they have responded to 145 incidents since yesterday morning around 6 o'clock. And they say, in part, the reason they don't use salt on their roads is because of the environment. From the coast to the gorge, ice and snow covered hundreds of miles of roadway throughout the region. In Portland, that ice made getting around next to impossible for some. The entire road is like a wonderful little ice skating rink. So uh, if you're an Olympic ice skater, get your skates out and you'll have fun. Warren Allen has problems getting around on two feet. And it's obvious so too did this TriMet bus at the intersection of Northeast 92nd and Fremont. These uh, events happen very rarely in Portland. The city of Portland says it laid down thousands of gallons of magnesium chloride de-icer. De-icer does not prohibit the road from freezing. What it does is it lowers the freezing temperature of water. Neither the city of Portland nor ODOT uses rock salt on its roads. Both agencies tell me the number one concern is the environment. We need to be careful about what we put in those rivers and make sure that as we're addressing even a really public emergency situation like this, we're not doing something that's going to have long-term really negative environmental consequences. And Ken and Jenny, authorities with uh, PDOT tell me that they are going to be sending out their trucks trying to clear out all the debris that remains on the roadways from uh, all the ice that has kind of been broken up as commuters have been out and about. But they say, again, the side streets not looking too good. And they say it may just take that warmer weather to finally melt. Back to you. All right. Thank you, Brent. You know, we